Good morning, everyone. Steve Georgie here from Allendale's Trading Floor. It is November 5th. Uh, we do have, well, we've got red on the screen here this morning. Corn down two and a quarter. We've got beans that are working about five cents lower and wheat down three and three quarter cents and probably for some good reasons. Uh, export sales came out today. Well, and they are pretty pathetic. Uh, corn, they were expecting 450 to 650,000 came out at 556, so neutral for corn. Little different story for beans and for wheat though. Beans, they were expecting 1.4 million to 1.8. We've seen good export sales, right? We've seen that over the last several weeks. Stronger sales being made, came out at 655,000. Yikes, um, that's, that's less than half of the lower end of the expectations. Uh, as far as wheat, they expected 300,000 to 500,000 came out at 84. So uh, still negative. We're still looking for some demand somewhere. We've got a lot of wheat out there. Uh, we went right to some technical areas yesterday as far as charts. So right up near some support for wheat for Chicago, that 530 area, starting to see us peel back a little bit here today, as I mentioned. But we'll keep an eye on things. You do have good support. We are still range bound right now for corn, beans, and wheat. Now we've got a USDA report out next week. A lot of focus will be on that. What are we looking for? What kind of expectations do we have? But the big thing is that we are expecting to see a rise in ending stocks uh, next week, and that may cap any kind of big bounce or, or, or rally that we may get. So keep an eye on that. So that's probably going to remain as more of this range bound trade. Now, livestock, cattle, no cash trades here as of yet. We've got the market right now, cattle market, down about $1.80 for fats at this point. Uh, box beef, kind of mixed, $1.74 higher choice, select down 63 but it's more of a technical slide than anything. On that December cattle chart, we did put in an island top there yesterday. Um, here we gap lower again today. Uh, charts do not look good at this point. So... Uh, we did take out some support already this morning. So keep an eye on cattle. There are expanded limits for cattle today. Uh, as far as the hogs, we are finding a little bit of support. In the, in the wake of all of what's going on with cattle, we are finding some support for hogs. Now, hogs have already taken a slide, and now we're finding some, uh, some areas where you do have a little bit of buying interest coming in here. Hogs right now, 30 to 40 cents higher this morning. Cutout values, though, dropping another $1.16. There is a significant discount right now in the December contract uh, to the hog index. And so I think we can get a little support out of the hogs uh, from these levels. Looking at stock market, up 50 points right now. Crude oil about unchanged. And we've got the dollar right now slightly higher, up just four cents. Give us a call if you have any questions. 800-262-7538 or on the web at allendale-inc.com. You guys have a great day out there uh, and we'll talk to you again tomorrow. Take care.